Hey y'all, just wanted to do a real quick review on a new 15 amp, 10 inch worm drive table saw from Skilt. So, this thing here, it's a beast. It's going to do everything you basically need it to do. A lot of features on this here, and hopefully this will help you make a more educated uh, buying decision when you're actually looking to purchase one of these. So, first things first, miter gauge, very nice, helps you make 45 degree cuts, different angles. Basically, just slide this in or out, whatever side you need it. There you go. Just tighten that down. It's not going anywhere, and you can make your cuts as such. What I really like about this saw here is the table itself. So you have a 4 by 8 piece of plywood. Just simply come up, flip that, grab this, slide it out, and there you go. No problem cutting a four by eight. All right, all you gotta do is slide it back in. Push this lever down, make sure that it's tight so it doesn't go anywhere. And you're right back to where you need it. So, as far as it goes with the rip fence, got a nice little storage area here. Very simple to install. So we're gonna come over here. Put it right down there on the track, as you can see. Slide this over a little bit more. And you just lock it into place. Voila. Simple, simple. So, one of the first things you need to remember when operating one of these is to make sure, please, that the guard is in place. Very simple to install, okay? You basically just latch it down on in there, push that down. That way, if something does happen, it's going to protect your fingers, okay? All right. Now, this is going to allow you, believe it or not, to cut a four by four if you needed to, all right? The height on this thing is unbelievable. There you go, look at that. And that's basically all you gotta do, just crank that lever right there. All right, you can see it going down. If I wanted to cut a 45 angle, once again, it's also very simple. So I'm basically, out of the way here. Basically, I'm gonna flip that right there, and there you go. It's gonna allow me to go 45 if I need to. I want to go 40, boom, right there. Just push that down in, make sure it's snug, and there's your 45. There you go. So that's very handy. Let's put this back in there. Zero degrees. All right. So, you always want a push stick, and this actually comes with one, which is nice. You don't have to worry about taking a little piece of wood and notching it out. It's like a hard rubber plastic right here, right? So you don't chop your fingers off. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually start this up, and uh, I'm going to run a 2x4 through it, let you see, you know, what it sounds like and, and how well it actually cuts. And what I like about this also is it... It comes with a really good blade, Diablo. You know, usually on, on these power tools, you'll go out and spend top dollar on, on one of these you know, table saws or sawzalls are the worst for this. They, they give you a really great tool and then they just throw in a really cheap blade. I don't understand that, um, but they don't do this here on the skill. They give you Diablo and uh, it's, it's probably top of the line if you ask me. So let's bring this down a little bit. We're gonna start her up. All well, you gotta come over here. All you gotta do is pull this. All right, so let's throw a two by four through there. That blade cuts through that wood like butter. Unbelievable. And you can see just how straight a line it cuts. Unbelievable. 
And there's your discharge right there. So you could just hook up a shot back or you know, some type of sweeper and, you know, instead of blowing everything all over the garage like I did, you know, it would go right into the shop back. So once again, uh, unbelievable saw. Doesn't really matter what type of cut you're, you're making. This is gonna do it and it's gonna do it well. This, this blade, you can just feel the power in this saw. So I think you're gonna be very happy with it. I hope this review helps. Thanks.